Good evening. Yep, obviously, because I think we did so well for 70 minutes that it's a pity. Therefore, the organization, the, the, the termination of the players was uh, really good. And it's a pity that at the end against a very good team, you can see the first goal that changed everything. And they continued pushing and pushing and it was difficult to defend. So uh, still we had chances in counter-attack, chances in the first half to score the third goal, chances in the second half to do a little bit better. And uh, we didn't score, and they were pushing, and they scored. Obviously, they changed. Uh, they put nearly four strikers at the same time. The substitutions, they are top-class players, and uh, it was difficult to stop, especially when you have players that they are getting tired and they have fresh legs and they have quality and and they are so strong like they are. Was the first half is pretty much as good as you played? Would you say and? and Really should you put again the game since it had really Yeah. The third the third goal was there, the chance that we had could change everything. But also in the second half we have a couple of them that we could do a little bit better, but uh, you cannot say too much. The players they give everything and they play so well that the, it's a pity but uh, you play you think about the substitutions that they made, they were even better uh, with these players and also the size and the ability and the pace that they have, so it's quite difficult and we did really well, so a bit. At any stage, did you feel a point would have been a good result? No, the first half, obviously no. The second half, when they were, when they made the substitution, you knew that um, you will be suffering and then we needed to be precise in the counter-attack and we did well, we, were what we wanted and still we missed this uh, final pass. And uh, then you try to push up, but uh, it was not easy. And uh, at the end, if you are defending crosses against seven players that they, they are so big, it's not easy. And also, even against Alexis, that is quite good in the air. Where does it, it leave you as a player has got up an international break? Obviously, they'll be quite downhearted. But I guess you'd want them to take some encouragement from, them, from the good bit. Yeah, I think everybody was disappointed in the Russian uh, room, and, but um, I told them, so we cannot complain about what we did. We cannot uh, be too upset because we did so well for a while that uh, we deserve more. But uh, when you play against these teams, we have five of the top six already, we play against them. So now, last year, uh, we were at the bottom in, in the uh, five teams at the bottom of the table in December and after we finish 10th, so this year hopefully will be the same. Rafa, te pregunto en español qué tal Dani Gil de la cadena Cope. Te pregunto por el rival. ¿Tienes la sensación de que esta remontada de United te muestra que todavía puede hacer grandes cosas en Liga? En inglés. ¿Has hablado con Mourinho? En inglés. I asked you about the rival, about Mourinho. He was in trouble before the the game. Do you think this victory shows United is able to do great things yet in the Premier League? Lo que dije antes del partido es que es un gran equipo y lógicamente un gran equipo eh, remontarán y estarán arriba. What I say before the game is a good team and for me they will be at the top of the table because they are a very good team. Y say hello. Le dije hola. Um, do you think in, in other areas you're just lacking that to see the result out tonight? Because it, it was there for you, wasn't it? Yeah, today I think it's not the day to complain about this. I think they did great. And it's just um, something that we need to learn for the future. So the team was uh, in control of the game for a while. And we have to be sure that we manage the situations a little bit better if we can, but uh, today you have to give credit to United, so it's just uh, the players that they had on the pitch with the pace, the size, the ability, the power, everything. So it was very difficult to stop them playing and we did it and we played uh, really well for a while. So and cannot complain about the players 
Uh, so what we have to do is uh, learn for the future and then carry on with the same team spirit and uh, the same way to play. The two big plus points were the, the goals from Ruto and Kennedy who been lacking so the, the confidence and opportunity that they got it tonight. Yeah, it's important for us um, to have more players scoring goals. It was a pity both players, they left the pitch uh, injured, but um, hopefully it would not be serious. But in the end, uh, it would be good also for the confidence, yes. Rafa, do you feel as though your, your team, your squad has improved from last year? You talk about you were up near the bottom last year and you got up to 10. You're at the bottom again and there's a gap starting to open. We have more or less the same squad. We changed some players, but uh, we did well because we were consistent and uh, we were working from the beginning until the end really hard. And then I think that we will do the same. Thank you.